Hello everyone, praise be to God, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories Reverse Re Rebirth. So, continuing with Riku's story, we've been Traverse Town and Agrabah, we have two cards left. Monstro, and Neverland. Neverland's a good one to finish, there are not a lot of annoying enemies there. And, well... Monstro, we don't want to be huge. We, we don't want Monstro to be super huge, so let's do Monstro next. We're back at the belly of the beast. Let's check out our deck. We have a few ones here and there, but not too bad. And the enemy card we get here is the Search Ghost. Absorb enemy HP when striking with attack cards. Doesn't drain all the HP you damage. In fact, you only get a little bit back for each attack. But still, that's a method of healing, so that's nice. I think the Jafar card will help us in this world. Oh boy, and tornado steps. Give me those experience points. There we go, not too bad, not too bad. Now let's go to the Dragon Maleficent card. I'm noticing the Jafar card is a lot more useful. It still takes pretty much the same amount of hits to kill people with the Dragon Maleficent card. And I guess I accidentally activated the Search Ghost <laughs> ability. Whoops! Only lasts for one reload as well, so that ended real fast. Oh, wait, how big is Monstro? It's decent sized. We probably won't have to visit all the rooms, though. Wow, one Mickey Mouse card killed both the barrel spiders, that's nice. Way to go, King Mickey. I wish the Jafar card wasn't as far away from my other cards as possible. Oh, and large bodies. Yeah, large bodies can be annoying to deal with. But I gotta level up, that's nice. And as you can see, the search ghost refilled my HP for me. That was nice. Alright, what to level up? Uh, let's we'll do DP. We got 20 DP now. That'll, <laughs> that'll be good for quite a while. Monstro is one of the reasons why I want to get the Jafar card early. Because <laughs> the one cards and the high value cards the Tornado Steps can have really can bog down your deck. Another level up. We'll boost HP. We have 200 HP, 14 attack, and 20 DP. I also feel like you don't level up as much as Riku. Like, maybe the worlds are smaller or something, I don't know. Or maybe it's just harder to grind on enemies. Level up, ooh, attack power please, and thank you. Alright, that was a lot of enemies in that room. Oh boy, we're at the boss door now. We need a blue card. We will use a moment's reprieve, followed by a key beginnings. 
Remember this guy, everybody? Yeah. He's back. Oh, yay, a Mickey Mouse card. Like, the boss Mickey Mouse cards. Now I just have a platform underneath me for a long while. So I don't have to even worry about the acid. Alright, go into Dragon Maleficent to deal some extra damage. Come on, Keen Mickey. Beat him up. Just a little bit. Okay, Parasite Cage that time was way easier than he was in Sora's story. Thanks to the game actually giving me the Mickey Mouse cards for the platform underneath me. And we get the Parasite Cage card. Who can be quite useful against some of the boss battles in Riku's story. Alright, time to find our way out. And we get to ignore half the rooms. Sleeping Darkness. We got a lot of them. I am out of map cards. I don't know how, but we are getting rid of all of our almighty darknesses. <laughs> And a lot of our moments reprieves. Alrighty, that clears out Monstro. Don't want to hit any of them barrels at all. Don't care for the barrels. Where did Vexen go? He's off using Riku's data to create some kind of replica. And what of Sora? Namine is shuffling his memories even as we speak. Marluxia may well get his puppet. He's a danger to us all. Larxene's not to be trusted either. Nor is Axel. Who knows what that one is thinking? Let's observe a little longer, then speak with Vexen. But Vexen despises Marluxia. Think of the mess it would create. That's why Vexen must be told. Better he clean up the mess than us. Oh ho. Manipulative, are you, Zexian? Well, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. Tune in next time. We'll be taking on Neverland, which will be the last world of our first deck, and we'll be fighting a special boss at the top of that floor. Hope to see you then. Until we meet again, have a great day, and God bless.